Have you ever woken up after a night of indulgence feeling like a freight train hit you? That, my friend, is a hangover. A hangover is the collection of uncomfortable symptoms that your body experiences after consuming alcohol. It's like your body's way of telling you that it's not too thrilled about what you put it through. Now, what does a hangover feel like? Well, it's different for everyone, but some common symptoms include headaches, muscle aches, nausea, and an overall feeling of fatigue. You might also experience psychological symptoms like feeling down or anxious. So, what causes a hangover? In a nutshell, it's the result of consuming more alcohol than your body can efficiently process. When you drink alcohol, your body has to work overtime to metabolize it, and this can lead to dehydration, inflammation, and a whole host of other unpleasant effects. So, you may ask, how long does this unpleasant experience last? Stay tuned to find out. Unravel the mystery of hangovers by diving deep into the science behind it. When you consume alcohol, it enters your bloodstream and affects your body in a multitude of ways. One of the primary impacts is dehydration. Alcohol is a diuretic, which means it makes you urinate more. As you drink, your body loses more fluid than it takes in, leading to dehydration. This dehydration is what's responsible for many classic hangover symptoms like headache, dizziness, and thirst. But there's more to the story. Alcohol is metabolized in your body by an enzyme known as alcohol dehydrogenase, which converts it into a compound called acetaldehyde. Acetaldehyde is highly toxic and can cause a range of unpleasant effects like nausea, vomiting, and facial flushing. Thankfully, your body also produces another enzyme called aldehyde dehydrogenase, which quickly breaks down acetaldehyde into harmless substances. However, when you consume large amounts of alcohol, your body can't keep up with the demand, leading to a buildup of acetaldehyde in your system. This accumulation can increase the severity of your hangover symptoms and can also contribute to the overall feeling of unwellness that accompanies a hangover. Moreover, alcohol interferes with your body's natural sleep rhythms. While it might make you feel sleepy and even help you nod off faster, it disrupts the quality of your sleep. You spend less time in the deep, restorative stages of sleep, leading to fatigue and poor concentration the next day. Alcohol also impacts your stomach lining, increasing acid production and slowing down the rate at which your stomach empties itself. This can result in feelings of nausea and stomach discomfort. So you see, a hangover isn't just one thing, it's a combination of dehydration, toxic acetaldehyde buildup, disrupted sleep, and upset stomach, all working together to make you feel miserable. Now that we understand the science, let's explore how long these effects can last. Hangovers can feel like they last forever but how long do they really last? Now that's a question many of us have asked ourselves on a Sunday morning. Hangovers can typically last anywhere from a few hours to a full day after drinking. Yes, you heard it right, a full 24 hours. But here's the catch, the duration can vary greatly from person to person. It's not a one-size-fits-all situation. A number of factors come into play. For instance, the amount of alcohol you consume can significantly impact how long you're going to feel the effects. The more you drink, the longer your hangover is likely to last. Next up, your individual tolerance to alcohol plays a key role. Some people can have a few drinks and wake up feeling fine, while others might feel the effects after just one or two. Your hydration levels also have a say in this. Alcohol can leave you dehydrated, and the more dehydrated you are, the worse your hangover symptoms can be. And let's not forget about your overall health. If your body is in good shape, it's better equipped to handle the aftermath of a night out. But if you're already under the weather, a hangover can hit you harder and last longer. While hangovers can be quite distressing, there are ways to alleviate the symptoms. So, chin up folks. Your hangover won't last forever, and we're going to talk about how to ease the pain in the next scene. Feeling hungover and looking for relief? Here are some tips. First and foremost, hydration is key. Alcohol can cause your body to lose fluids, leading to dehydration and some of the physical symptoms of a hangover. So, make sure to drink plenty of water or other hydrating fluids. Rest is another crucial element in hangover recovery. Your body needs time to recover from the physical stress of excessive alcohol consumption. So, allow yourself to take it easy, perhaps even sneaking in an extra nap or two. Eating easily digestible foods can also help. Alcohol can irritate your stomach lining, leading to discomfort or nausea. Opt for bland foods that are easy on your stomach like toast or rice. While you might be tempted to reach for pain relief medication, be cautious. Some medications like paracetamol can cause liver damage when combined with alcohol. Instead, consider non-prescription remedies such as aspirin, ibuprofen, or natural remedies like ginger or honey. 
Importantly, remember that these are just temporary fixes. They can help you feel better, but they don't address the root cause of your hangover, which is drinking too much alcohol in the first place. So while these tips can help, the best way to prevent a hangover is to drink in moderation. Prevention is better than cure, especially when it comes to hangovers. There's no guaranteed way to avoid the aftermath of a night out, but your best bet is to drink in moderation or better yet, abstain from alcohol altogether. After all, the only surefire way to dodge a hangover is to not usher it in to begin with. But what if you're dealing with more than just the occasional morning after headache? If you're experiencing frequent and severe hangovers, it may be a sign of a deeper issue with alcohol consumption or even addiction. In these cases, seeking professional help becomes imperative. Please seek the advice and help of your doctor. Remember, your health comes first. If you found this video useful, leave a comment below. Don't forget to use our calorie and protein calculator in the description below to kickstart and track your fitness journey. And before you go, thank you so much for watching our video, and please make sure to subscribe to our channel. If you want to try our 90-day dopamine detox challenge, watch the video on your screen next.